Hello everyone, this is Leanna Howe, an engineer from Saratech, and welcome to our Tips and Tricks tutorial series. Today I will be talking to you about measuring mass properties in your NX models. If you have any questions about anything covered in this tutorial, please be sure to ask your questions in the comments below. Now, NX can automatically create attributes and expressions for the mass properties of a part or assembly. To turn these on, go to File, Utilities, Customer Defaults, Gateway, Materials forward slash mass, then underneath the part attributes tab, scroll down until you see the part mass section. Now there will be options for NX to create both an attribute or an expression. Both will display the same information and it is simply up to your preference whether you would like your mass properties displayed in your expressions or part attributes. Select the box for NX to create either. The name of the expression or attribute can be edited in, in this input box below. As you can see, the default name is mass prop mass. Now go to the rollup attributes tab. Similarly, you can create an expression or attribute for the mass prop rollup mass, and the name of the expression can be edited in this text box. So the mass prop mass attribute automatically created by NX displays the mass properties of any geometry created within the current part file. So I've now created this simple box model. To ensure that the mass properties are updating, go to File, Properties, and then under Mass, make sure this Update Mass Properties on Save box is checked. Press OK, save your part, and then reopen your part properties, and then under attributes, you can go and check that your mass prop mass has been created and it's been updated. Now I've created an NX assembly containing two of our box models. Once again, ensure that the mass properties are updating by going to File, Properties, then under the Mass tab, make sure that this Update Mass Properties on Save box is checked. Press OK, save the file and reopen. Checking the part attributes, you can see that NX has created this mass prop rollup mass attribute that contains the mass of all parts within the assembly. Thank you for watching this video on measuring mass properties within NX. Please remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more helpful tutorials. And if you have any suggestions or requests for future tutorial topics that you would like us to create, please comment them below. Thank you again for watching and see you next time. Thanks for checking out our channel. If you like what you saw, make sure to like and subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any new videos. Follow us on LinkedIn, Facebook, and Twitter for the latest engineering news and information. And to see all of our upcoming events, please visit our website at saratech.com events.